Hello, today I'm going to tell you the story of Christine de Pisan, how she became mother, author and world's first feminist. Her life started simple. Christine de Pisan was born in 1364 in Venice. Her father was an astrologer and educated Christine in different fields like medicine, Latin and physics, which was very unusual for a father to educate his daughter during medieval times. During medieval times, women were meant to work in a household and not meant to work in scientific fields. When she was four years old, her father was appointed by the French king, Karl V, to be his personal doctor after the plague. So Christine moved to France with her whole family. In France, she met Etienne du Castel and was married to the royal secretary when she, at the age of 15. In medieval times for women to marry at a very young age. Most of the women were under 18. Later on in her life, she had great financial worries because her father and her husband passed away due to a pandemic. Although it was common for a widow to marry another man, Christine decided against it because she still loved her husband. But nevertheless, she faced financial problems. So she started writing poems and books, which contained subjects like peace, the state, biologic biographies of famous statesmen and so on. Christine, however, had to use a male pseudonym to publish her work because women were not allowed to publish, write and read books. In contrast to my thesis that she only wrote uh, with a male pseudonym, she wrote one book with her real name. It was called La Cité C des Dames, which roughly translated means the book of the city of women. She wrote the book in 1404. Here you can see two pictures of the book which it looked like. In this book she defends herself against the hateful, false and vicious claims by men regarding the female sex. This book received the most attention of all. The main aim of her work was to show that women had the same mental abilities as men. After her book Les City des Dames got a lot of attention she was invited by the French Queen Isabelle de Bavière. She was the wife of Charles III. Christine de Pisan was able to pursue the Pius Marshal to found an order whose task it was to stand up for women. Unfortunately, the order remained quite, quite ineffective. Nevertheless, her fight for women and their equality with men did not lead to any change in the behavior of male sex towards the female. But as a lone fighter, she hardly had a chance to enforce it.